Check that out. I didn't bring my GoPro. I forgot my damn GoPro, but I just drilled a hole straight through. And then I drilled down it quite a ways, so <laughs> we got a nice little flow there. Filling up quick. That was bone dry. This is a uh, this is that place where the, the beavers dammed this up and the water they busted a hole through the levee and it's flooding that side. I was gonna tanner right this, but I just don't think I can get a good distance to shoot through. There's a lot of wood in here too. But uh be interesting this this will basically get us some flow here uh still got a few beavers they're way up there a ways i gotta go and put in some 330s i wish i had to run my gopro get this opened up more Just filming with my phone So just because you ain't got a GoPro don't mean you can't make videos, guys. I know a lot of people are like, man, I don't have a GoPro. Yeah, here I am. Trying. <laughs> Ooh, that's deep. That ought to get a little bit of a lot of water. We're going to drain this completely. And then I'm going to go in there and set. Dang it, I'm going under. Oh, oh. oh man, man down. Woo boy. Filling up. There's another dam down there, but I'm not gonna worry about that one. It's really low compared to this one. I would say she'll drop pretty quick. All right, stay tuned. I'm gonna knock that little piece out right there. Something about the running water that people love. But she sure is ripping out of there now. We are making some good progress. Look at this. <laughs> I don't know why that. I don't know why that uh, does that. Oh, we're already over. I thought I was going to hoping to get here before it went over. Oh man. Shit. You going over now? He's ripping and roaring now, boys. Let's get to the front of the line. Hasn't been water running this way in a while. Got some debris. Boy, look at this freaking coyote trail right here. What? Why ain't I got a coyote set on that? Here she goes. She's coming now. Oh, man. This is... There very possibly is a giant dam down here too. God dang it. <laughs> We're coming now. Reminds me when I was a kid. We used to build like little racetracks and then we'd flood them with the garden house. Look at this. 
you know where the coyotes are running, guys? Right here. Yeah, put some cable restraints right here. I think we're gonna run into a giant dam down here. I don't know why this is so intriguing. Watching it fill up. The old creek runs again. This is what she's supposed to look like. Besides that trash. What does that say? Animal bedding. What do you guys think? We just follow this and see where it meets the old leather beaver dam. I think it's another, that's what they say, you know? Here's another dam right here. And then the creek looks like she should flow good. Once it gets past this, I think we'll have enough water that it'll go over this. This is just a small dam, hopefully. <laughs> oh man. Coyote Central. I gotta put some cable restraints on here. It's perfect, there's like no entanglement. It's just a beautiful run. Trash. Okay, here's where the water's just starting. It's just starting to push right there. She's coming now. Just starting to push through the wave so that'll all just back up up there now well, we got this wee little dam here and the big one's still pumping some water out so we're gonna stomp on this a little bit get her going she's been dry for a while so she's hard she could have grew grass Raging now. So we broke this second dam. Probably end up having to break that other one down farther next couple days. But we're going to get the pressure off of that hole that's in the levee way up there. So now she's falling good. That's what our creek is supposed to look like. The only problem is. This will go all the way, turn the corner, and flood where I'm coyote trapping. <laughs> you guys have seen me driving on the ice in previous years, so that's why that's where this all comes from. Well, pissing them off. <laughs> 